Hey guys, my name is Tano from Project 90 by 2030. Today we're going to be teaching you guys how to do solar water heating. Some basic materials you're going to be needing is black PVC pipe around 25 mils in diameter, at least 20 meters of it in length. You're then going to need a craft knife to be able to cut our pipe. You're going to need a clear plastic bottles, at least 50 of these or enough to cover the entire length of our black PVC pipe. You're going to need a hose connector and then lastly some sealing tape for your hose connector. So why does this work? The aim of solar water heating is to heat the water up using the sun's energy before it enters your geyser. The warmer the water entering the geyser, the less energy your geyser is going to be taking in order to heat that water. This has the result of saving you in electricity and saving you in terms of money. So the first thing we need to do is to then determine the north facing side of our roofs. Uh, we're in the southern hemisphere, so the, the, the north gets the most amount of sun during the day. The north is also going to be the side that we're going to be running our solar water heating system from. The first step uh, to our solar water heating system is to insulate our black PVC pipe. To do this, we're going to need our clear Coke bottles. The first thing that we do is at the top of our Coke bottle, you cut off the top and then you cut off the bottom. Once you've done this, you do this to all of your Coke bottles. And then you simply take one Coke bottle and you slide the one end over a black PVC pipe like so. And then you continuously just keep sliding bottles over and making sure that you leave no spaces in between the bottles where the air can escape. Once you've done this across the entire length of your pipe, your pipe is now ready to be assembled into your gear. So next we need to connect now our, our hose connector into our black PVC pipe. And to do this, you merely take your hose connector, connect it to your black PVC pipe like that. 